Today we are going to flash TWRP on our Samsung M30 but before that I'd like to tell you that the following procedure carries risks of boot loop or breaking of your Android device. The data on your phone is definitely going to be erased. Kindly proceed on your own risk. You can always seek for help in comments in case you face any issue. Now before we start make sure that your M30 is up to date and has May security patch. If not kindly update to the latest firmware. Now first of all we'll unlock the bootloader. This setting can be found in developer options. If you haven't enabled developer options yet go to about phone software information and tap build number multiple times until you see this toast message saying that you're now a developer. Now get back to the main screen and go to developer options find USB debugging and enable it then find OEM unlocking and enable it to unlock bootloader now you'll be asked your pin or pattern if you have set then you'll have to put you your Samsung account password and then your phone will boot and your data will be erased once your phone boots you'll have to enable developer options once again You would also have to enable USB debugging once more. Now you can move to your PC. On your PC you would need Odin file, TWRP for M30 in tar format and make sure the ADB is properly working and uh, the Samsung drivers are installed. Now connect your M30 with a USB-C cable to your computer. Now open the command window and type ADB devices to make sure that ADB is working properly. If you see this device ID it means your ADB is good to go. Now type ADB reboot download to go into download mode. Your phone screen will turn blue and it will be something like this. Now open Odin. This bar shows that your phone is connected. Go to options. Make sure to untick auto reboot and repartition. Now select AP slot. And pick the TWRP for M30. It will be in tar format. Once the TWRP file is opened in AP slot, tap on start. You will see this pass message over here that confirms that the TWRP has been successfully flashed. Now let's get back to our phone. Your phone would be in download mode with this sky blue screen then press volume down and uh, power button and hold until the screen turns off and when the screen turns off quickly leave the volume down button and press and hold volume up button along with the power button and when samsung logo appears leave the power button and keep holding volume up button until twrp boots up now you'll see something like this. Now swipe to allow modifications. Go to wipe section. Select format data. Type yes to format your data. It's very important. Once that's done, go back. This time select advanced wipe. 
and select cash and swipe to wipe now get back to the main page select reboot and select recovery and then choose do not install now your phone will reboot into recovery now in recovery tap on install select dm verity disabler zip and flash it this is also another very important part of this whole procedure now we'll again reboot to recovery and not into the system then again we'll tap on install and this time we're going to flash magisk yes this will root your phone and in my case when i did not uh, flash magisk my phone didn't boot up it just didn't go to system at all after flashing magisk you can reboot your phone to system and uh, after taking a little bit of time it will boot up Now enjoy the root features and TWRP on your Samsung Galaxy M30. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.